Welcome to Destination Diana, your self-help learning library, where we discuss everything self-help. So anything that you can do to help yourself, that's the focus. So it is a beautiful day in Dallas. Welcome to people that are new to my channel and for those that have been rocking with me since June of 2020, welcome back. So I'm actually on my way to uh, bring my mom her phone. Um, she left it. So I'm going to take a quick ride, drop off her phone, and we're going to have a little conversation. my life and relationship was going um and I felt very stuck stuck meaning whichever way I went it was not the ideal um it was almost like having to choose you know the the best of the worst that's the best way I can put it So when you're faced with a bunch of options that you don't necessarily want, but you know you have to make a decision. Um, when you get to places in your life where there isn't movement, there isn't growth, um, or the movement that is happening is not in a direction that you want, you have to look within. Um, and do a self evaluation. So that's what I did. I looked at myself and I said, okay, what am I working on? What are my goals? How does this impact my kids? How does this impact my husband? Um, how does this impact our overall family and relationship? Um, and I considered that. But then I had to think about the fact that I am no good to other people if I do not take care of myself. And as, you know, a relationship coach, life coach, a person, even in my nine to five work job, I'm an account manager. So I'm always organizing things for people. I'm always the go-to for advice. I'm always helping everyone else. And it's a blessing. I'm glad that God made me that type of person, gave me those type of skills and, you know, put that calling on my life to help others. However, I just think I'm in a season right now that I have to help myself. Um, I 
I don't want to get too far away from the goals that I have and I don't want to steer too far away from the progress that I've been making the progress I've been making physically how I look um, becoming more healthy choosing healthier things for my life um, just wanting to grow and completely level up um, that's my focus for myself so everything in my life has to align with that and the reason why I feel like this is so important to share is because I know so many women especially after marriage or having kids like big transitions in a woman's life they completely lose themselves in what they are to everyone else the wife the mother the daughter-in-law the everything they lose themselves in you know their quest to be the best wife mother whatever it is um and i've been guilty of that completely losing who i am what makes me me because i'm trying to do and be all things for everyone else so this is me just pumping the brakes stopping and saying you know what i gotta recalibrate i need a renewed sense of self I need peace I need space um, and the freedom to be me um, and for me that included a move um, I moved from Virginia to Dallas Texas um, my mom is here that's really helpful um, when you connect with your mom, she knows you at a level that, you know, not too many other people will know you. Um, and my mom personally could tell, like, something was not right with me. Um, I wasn't in a good space. It was becoming very hard to manage everything in my life. Um, from being a wife to a mom, full-time job, you know, growing my coaching business, even growing this YouTube channel. Um, actually growing the YouTube channel has helped me a lot because it gave me something to focus on where I could use my creative juices I could give a lot of advice um, and I could talk about a lot of things um, so it was almost like my, my self healing and therapy um, which is what I want this to be for you guys like these videos I want you to learn and grow with me I'm going to be sharing my experience sharing you know things that I've learned in my coaching practice and jobs I've held and just real life experience um, I'm in no way an expert <laughs> you know the only thing I'm an expert at is living life and learning <laughs> from the decisions and you know oftentimes mistakes that I make so I'm gonna continue to do that and I know this is kind of like a rant but it's like my walk and talks I guess this is like car conversation you know how I am I like to have cute little names for everything but um, that's a little update on me where I am mentally and physically um, yeah so like the video <laughs> if you like it um, and make sure you subscribe uh, become a part of the godly tribe subscribe to the channel so you're notified whenever I upload a new video um, leave me a comment let me know like did any of my rant resonate with you have you been faced with difficult decisions um, are you having a hard time getting back to yourself would you guys like more videos about self-care um, mental health self-improvement let me know what topics you want me to cover and i make i will make sure that i do that all right guys see you in the next video